Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna take you along with me while I clean and get the housework done, feeling very poorly, very unwell, very tired, but I know that I will feel better if I just get some stuff done and then I can rest for the rest of the day. That is the plan. So I'm gonna start my little power hour by doing the laundry. I'm gonna take the dry washing off the washing rack, fold that up. Some of it's still a little bit wet, so I'm gonna leave some of it on the rack. So I'm gonna sort out what's ready to come off. I'm gonna fold that up, ready to be put away. I'm also going to put on a fresh load. This is such a good way to feel productive when I'm actually not being productive at all. <laughs> it's a surefire way to feel like you are getting something done. Pop the washing machine on. So I'm just putting on a mixed load of clothes. It's some of mine, some of Clint, some of the kids. I think this is just a bit of everything. I'm just going to chuck it on. I'm also going to sort out the tumble dryer, there was some stuff in here to be taken out and folded so I will do that first and then put the stuff in there that needs to be dried with a dryer sheet. Next I'm going to empty the bin, this has been needing to be emptied ugh, as you can see for a couple of days and I know I'll feel better if I just get it done. So I'm going to empty the rubbish out of the bin and then I will give the bin a good clean. I try and clean the bin every time I empty it, that way it never builds up and it never becomes filthy because obviously bins can become filthy very quickly and very easily. So if I give it just a wipe down with a cloth and a flash spray every time, then it leaves it looking quite clean and smelling not like a bin. I'm gonna take this rubbish out onto the bins on the drive as well so that it's out of the house. First time I've been outside today <laughs> as my friend helped me with the school run this morning so it will feel good to get a bit of fresh air on my face as well. Next up, I'm just gonna quickly wipe down the sides in the kitchen. I'm using a fresh cloth and just a flash multi-purpose surface spray. And I'm just gonna wipe down all of the kitchen surfaces. They're not particularly dirty, to be honest, but I will just feel better if I give them a good wipe and make them all nice and shiny. It's so expected. I'm also just gonna load the dishwasher. There were some plates gathering in the sink and on the side, obviously, where I just haven't been bothered to put anything away properly. So I'm gonna put them all in the dishwasher, ready to be cleaned when it's full. Where the plates and cups have been sitting in the sink, it has built up and become a bit dirty in the sink. So I'm just gonna take two minutes to clean this quickly because I know I'll feel so much better if I do. I'm just using my scrub daddy soap sponge device thing. I don't really know what you call this, but the handle is filled with dish soap. So it makes it so easy to wipe down the surfaces. I'm just gonna go over all of the surfaces in the sink with the nice soapy suds. 
Then I'm just going to wash that all away and I will go over with a cloth just to buff it slightly. It probably took me less than two minutes but I feel so much better for having it done. I was hoping to get away with not cleaning the oven but we obviously used the hob last night for dinner and it does need cleaning so I'm just going to do a super super quick clean, not a deep one, just using the flash spray and a cleaning cloth and I'm just going to wipe and go over it. I am normally more thorough than this, I will normally get in there and take all the bits of the hob off, I really really can't be doing with that today, this is just sort of a surface quick clean just to make myself feel better. Now that the kitchen is looking clean and tidy, I'm just going to light a candle in here just to signify that I have at least done this area of the house. Okay, into the kids' play area and the dining area now. Obviously, there's toys everywhere. Cooper is at home. He's actually down for a nap while I'm filming this. So he's been playing in here all morning, which is why it is a bit of a mess. So I'm going to tidy up first and foremost before I do anything else. Now I'm just going to wipe down the surfaces on the dining table, obviously the boys had breakfast on here not long ago, Cooper has also had lunch on here, so there is some food build up and things that I just need to wipe away. And I am going to vacuum the hard floors. I nearly didn't do this as I was getting so tired by this point. I just had no energy with this awful flu thing that I had. But the floors were building up and I was just feeling all the bits under my feet and I knew I wanted to get it done. So I'm just gonna quickly go over all of the hard floors around the bottom of the house. Why you wanna run away? Why you gotta be I wish I could make you stay Cause baby I love Whilst I was vacuuming, I noticed that there was quite a bit of food marks and things on the boys' play mat. So I'm just gonna get on my hands and knees with a cloth and the same flash spray that you have seen me use for this entire video. And I'm just gonna scrub it in those areas where I saw bits of food and things that have been trodden into the play mat. The only thing I'm gonna do upstairs, one, because I have absolutely no energy left and I just wanna collapse, and two, because Cooper is asleep up here, is I'm just gonna make the bed. If you are not well, if you're not feeling up to it and you only have a little bit of energy and there's only one thing you can do that day, then make the bed. It always makes me feel so much better if the bed is made, it makes me feel productive, it makes the house feel neat and tidy. So that's the only thing that I'm gonna do upstairs. That probably took me about 30 minutes, but I feel so much better for it. I am obviously exhausted now. <laughs> I need to sit down, take some medicine and rest, but I'm so glad that I whizzed around and got things done quickly. Thank you so much for watching guys, and I will see you in my next video. Wherever you go, I'll be there.